on this Father's Day, it almost goes without saying that my father had the biggest impact on my life. He was my Sunday school teacher from the day I was in Sunday school. He taught me Christ's stories through the Bible out of the Old Testament and the New Testament and gave me a very good understanding of God's character and his saving grace. He ultimately helped lead me to Christ by asking me that question of whether I would or would not follow Christ and I have chosen to do so. But beyond that, within the Salvation Army, I've also come to know another man who has since been promoted to glory, Ron White. And it was his humble ways as well in teaching what the Bible had to say, in leading Bible studies and spending many, many hours as just a friend discussing and working through the Bible and coming to understand it. With his help, I have known far better Jesus' love through the studies that he has provided. So the person that I want to talk about as being an inspiring father figure, father and um, man, is a man who is very happy to journey alongside people. Sometimes he's a leader, other times he's a follower. Uh, he takes time to understand different perspectives. He is a quiet achiever. He's a helper. He's a motivator and he's most certainly a guide. And he astounds me with the number of ways that he can find to show love in um, in all sorts of ways that I never ever could imagine. And every time it does happen um, in a different kind of way, I'm inspired again um, and, and motivated myself to move on and show people love in the best way possible. And that person, uh, that man that inspires me the most is my husband Adrian, the father to our three children and certainly a father figure, an uncle, a brother, a son to many, many more. I've been asked by Captain to speak on someone who was helpful to me and I want to refer to a a dear brother that I met when I was 16, Brother Ted Farragher. Our brother Ted Farragher was a Manxman, a very, very good man with his Bible, and he used to take Bible study. And at 16 and a half, I was going to Ted's Bible study. Now if everybody wants to know who Ted Farragher is, that's Graham and Laurel and all the crew and Alice's husband. Wonderful Christian gentleman. Now another lovely man that I still miss is our dear friend David Powell. Uh, David and I used to have some lovely talks on the way home after band practice. And it wouldn't matter what subject you talked about, David would always have very good advice and a very generous man. And I give praise for both of these gentlemen because they've had quite an influence on my life. Praise God and I thank you for them. Amen. <laughs>